Seleniums Tools Suit. <coughs> uh, tell me Krishna Chaitanya, uh, forget about Selenium 1. Now Selenium 2 is latest one. Uh, what are the four tools in Selenium tool? Uh, Selenium 2, Selenium IDE, RC, WebDriver and Selenium, Selenium 3. Okay. First I am taking Selenium IDE, Integrated Development Environment. It has menus. If you want to generate test, test case, you can use recording feature. If you want to execute, you can use a run feature, a playback. It has menus. Selenium IDE. Actually, it is not a it is not an independent tool like UFT. It is Firefox plugin. See. It is a Firefox browser plugin it is a firefox browser plugin used to create and execute test cases used to create and execute test cases it is a Firefox plugin. Means on Firefox only you can install Selenium IDE. For example, UFT, independent tool. You can install UFT independently. With no other software support, UFT can work. RFT, independent tool. But Selenium IDE is a plugin. Selenium IDE is a Firefox browser plugin. On Firefox only, you can install Selenium IDE. See, you can get one more point. <clears throat> it is Firefox, since it is Firefox plugin, it doesn't support other browsers, Google Chrome. Uh, that one Internet Explorer etc browsers it is a Firefox plugin <clears throat> uh, Sri Lakshmi uh, any other points regarding this Selenium IDE I think here you can do record and play ah, only ah, record and play only so you use it to create and execute test cases, record and play, uh, record and playback, playback only. Uh, any other? Okay. See. <clears throat> See, I will give brief introduction. Anyhow, in Selenium IDE chapter, I will discuss. Uh, uh, once again, I will discuss theory as well as practical concepts. See, Selenium IDE features. <clears throat> Next, drawbacks. Drawbacks of Selenium IDE. These two points I will explain in this chapter. In Selenium IDE chapter, we will discuss theory as well as practical examples. Okay, say it is used to create test cases. Say features create test cases, test suits, uh, means uh, test batches. See, for creating test cases, you can use a recording feature or if you know the syntax, you can type test, uh, test steps. If you know the syntax, you can type test steps. Otherwise, you can use recording feature. 
see we can <coughs> record test cases or type test steps using <coughs> element locators what is element locator we will discuss later and selenium ide commands selenus commands see element locator for recognizing object selenus command for performing operation on that element first recognizing object and performing operation on that object okay create test cases we can use recording feature or you can type test steps next <clears throat> execute test cases one by one or test suits next debug <coughs> debug test cases see debug debugging means locating and isolating errors through step by step execution next enhance test cases see enhancing means adding comments inserting verification points etc see create test cases execute test cases debug test cases enhance test cases next edit test cases you can edit existing test cases edit test cases next export test cases using any supported format export test cases using any supported formats for example java format next ruby format etc <coughs> say exporting facility is there but this feature is not working properly anyhow selenium ide is not useful tool nowadays most of the selenium developers most of the companies also using selenium web driver okay just we will learn selenium ide in real time limited use or no use see export test cases to other formats other supporting formats you can use java ruby etc next selenium test case default format is html see selenium ide test case default format is html okay this is a brief introduction about selenium id i will explain drawbacks also uh, before that tell me rahman what is selenium id what is the use of uh, otherwise what is the purpose of selenium id selenium id is one of the sweet tools of selenium Uh, so the one of the tool of selenium so firefox ah uh. yeah it's a plugin only support firefox browser but uh. it doesn't support other browser such as uh. first of uh, all it is not it is not an independent tool on firefox browser only we can install and use okay right next it uh, it doesn't support other browsers such as google chrome and okay. ie okay okay 
and it's execute test cases. Ah, test it is suite. used to create test cases and test suits, the set That's of right. test cases. Ah, next. It also, it also help us to debug test cases. Ah. This is a, a step by step execute test cases. Yes, for by executing step by step, uh, you can debug test cases. It also support enhanced test cases. Ah, enhanced test cases. Yeah. By yeah, adding also, comments, uh, by comments, inserting verification points, we can enhance. Yeah. Continue. Also, it helps us to edit test cases. Mm. It uh, support export test cases uh, using uh, any supporting formats. Such ah, as Java, other supporting Ruby. formats, Java, Ruby, Python, etc. But this feature is not working properly, but facility is there. Okay. Also, Selenium ah. ID, a default format is HTML. Okay, good. Next, drawbacks, drawbacks. Vijaya, contribute. Uh, what are the drawbacks? Just guess drawbacks of Selenium ID. Drawbacks. Oh, very much, very. I, don't have, I don't have any idea about that. I, I don't have any idea about that. Okay, cool, Selenium cool. No, no problem. Preeti, can you guess some drawbacks of Selenium ID? Say, as per this first point, you can explain one drawback. Yeah, uh, programming knowledge is required. See, what is this point? It is a Firefox browser plugin. Uh, based on that, you tell me one drawback. It supports Mozilla Firefox. Mozilla Firefox browser only doesn't support other browsers this is one drawback ah, next continue continue srivalli mm -hmm. okay 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 otherwise preeti preeti joshi Preeti. Yeah, I don't know, sir. Sorry. Okay. Krishna Chaitanya. As it does not use programming languages, yes. so for complex projects, we cannot use this yes. Selenium ID. Good. It doesn't support programming logic or programming features to enhance test cases. See, it doesn't support programming languages, but WebDriver, see, already we discussed Selenium supports Java, Perl, Python, Ruby. Those supporting environments for Selenium RC and Selenium WebDriver but Selenium IDE doesn't support programming using element locators and Selenium IDE commands or you can say Selenus commands. You can create and execute test cases, but no programming. You cannot use conditional statements, loop statements and other programming features like variables, constants, data types, functions, methods, etc. It doesn't support. Next. It doesn't support data driven testing. See for data driven testing resource required. Test data file is resource. If we use Selenium web driver WebDriver supports data driven testing, but Selenium IDE doesn't support data driven testing. See. It is not suitable. It is not suitable for complex test case design. Why? No programming support. 
only selenium commands selenium ide commands so not suitable for complex test case design only for simple test case design tushar any other points tushar amin uh, uh, actually no um... okay cool no problem no problem drawbacks of selenium sri lakshmi yeah i don't have any idea okay. so say uh, in selenium ide no object repository concept if it is eft eft has object repository using object repository you can maintain objects in in a centralized location but in selenium ide no object repository so no centralized no centralized maintenance no centralized maintenance of objects or you can say elements objects no centralized maintenance of objects uh, vijaya can you give one or two examples for web objects in functional testing oh. we use object concept give one or two examples i i know pardon i know the object is jde because i uh, i know the object is jde that is how like uh, in, um, when we do any kind of program develop any kind of program so usually we create the object so uh, give some examples in uh, give uh, some examples in objects object software objects in web applications okay okay preeti joshi software objects examples in web environment radio button yes radio button <coughs> edit box link image list box check box drop down, uh, drop -down box check box etc okay see these are the <coughs> important drawbacks of selenium ide just tushar list out nearly we discussed uh, five disadvantages or drawbacks of selenium ide what are the drawbacks uh, one thing is the, uh, it's work only on uh, firefox browser yes works and only also... on firefox browser it is firefox plugin it doesn't support uh, yeah. other browsers next uh it doesn't support the programming logic and features uh ah. so in that way you cannot enhance the yes test we cases. cannot we cannot use programming features for enhancing test cases next uh it doesn't support the uh, data driven testing s yes. and also uh, it's not uh, suitable for complex test test case design test case design ah uh, next and uh, it doesn't have object repository so uh, so no centralized yeah. maintenance of objects or elements it doesn't have object repository so no centralized maintenance of objects okay shall we move to next topic uh, saujanya okay now selenium id yes sir next selenium rc this is outdated see i will explain selenium web driver selenium uh, see uh, selenium rc selenium web driver both are same same in purpose selenium web driver is more powerful than selenium rc you no need to learn selenium rc it is outdated successor of selenium rc is selenium web driver but uh, selenium rc supports various programming languages for enhancing test cases selenium rc supports various operating environments next selenium rc supports various browsers 
See, remember three points. Selenium RC supports various programming languages and supports various browsers and supports various operating environments. But it is outdated tool. The successor of Selenium RC is Selenium Web Driver. Selenium Web Driver. Say, <clears throat> what is Selenium Web Driver? It is a programming interface. It is a programming, a programming interface to create and execute test cases. It is a programming interface. Say it doesn't have IDE. It doesn't have IDE. No menus. For each and everything we need to write the code. For example, UFT, formerly QTP. UFT has IDE as well as programming interface. Just a minute. UFT, it has IDE as well as programming interface. You can use IDE and programming interface for creating test cases. See, this is UFT tool. Just observe. Just a minute. Observe. Suppose if you want to create any test case, you can use tool features. IDE, see, it has menus. ID, you can use tool features. Otherwise, you can type, this is editor, UFT tool editor. You can type test cases. If you know the syntax, you can type test cases. See, UFT, formerly QTP, it has IDE as well as programming interface this is tool editor this white color area is tool editor you can generate test cases using tool features or you can type test cases it has ide as well as programming interface but selenium web driver doesn't have ide only programming interface only editor you can type test steps and execute. Next, compare to Selenium IDE. Selenium IDE has IDE, but no programming interface. Getting this point, Rahman, try to understand. Suppose, yes, sir. Selenium IDE has IDE. IDE means Integrated Development Environment menus and menu items available you can use that features but doesn't have programming interface okay next selenium web driver Selenium web driver has programming interface. Programming interface. But Srivalli, but doesn't have IDE. IDE. No menus and no menu items. Next, UFT, formerly QTP. QTP has both IDE as well as a programming interface.
ఓకేనా ఓకేనా శ్రీవల్లి దిస్ కాన్సెప్ట్ బేసికల్లీ సెలీనియం వెబ్ డ్రైవర్ ఈజ్ ఎ ప్రోగ్రామింగ్ ఇంటర్ఫేస్ ఇట్ డజంట్ హ్యావ్ ఎనీ ఐడి నో మెనూస్ నో మెనూ ఐటమ్స్ ఓకే ఫర్ రీచ్ అండ్ ఎవ్రీథింగ్ యూ నీడ్ టు రైట్ ద కోడ్ హియర్ టూ ఇంపార్టెంట్ కాన్సెప్ట్స్ ఇన్ ఫంక్షనల్ టెస్ట్ ఆటోమేషన్ ఫస్ట్ వన్ ఈజ్ రికగ్నైజింగ్ ద ఆబ్జెక్ట్ సెకండ్ వన్ ఈజ్ పెర్ఫార్మింగ్ ఆపరేషన్ ఆన్ దట్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్ suppose one link is there <coughs> recognizing the link is object identification next performing operation click link clicking on link is operation suppose edit box is object recognize edit box then enter some value into edit box entering some value into edit box is operation see for recognizing objects as well as performing operations on objects we use programmatic steps only in web driver no ide okay next as usual uh, tell me samir arora uh, features of selenium web driver have any idea what is selenium web driver sayed alam can you tell me one or two features of okay okay samir okay tell me one or two features of selenium web driver sayed alam yes sir uh, it is a programming interface uh, to create and execute test cases yes it is a programming interface to create and execute test cases okay and uh, selenium web driver has programming interface uh, but uh, doesn't have any id okay so there is no menus and everything tell me new point okay selenium web driver selenium web driver supports selenium web driver supports java okay but selenium ide doesn't support any programming language java next c sharp next uh, perl. Uh, perl next uh, python uh, python yeah next ruby or you can use php selenium web driver supports various programming languages various programming environments various programming environments to write test cases to write programs next <clears throat> using element element means object object element locators using element locators for example <clears throat> edit box is element locator is id id or name suppose link is element uh, see uh, selenium web driver supports eight element locators that we will discuss later anyhow it is brief introduction about selenium web driver suppose link is element link text is element locator link text value is gmail that is value suppose man man is object name or surname or height or weight or color all are properties are locators 
locators or you can say properties property it is a it describes the object it is an attribute of the object property it is an attribute of the object it describes the object suppose man is object or element properties name name is one property surname height weight width color etc uh, see name name srivalli srivalli is a value suppose name is property value is some samir samir is value okay using element or object locators locator or property using element locators and web driver web driver methods using element locators and web driver methods we can create and execute test cases okay now this point vijaya using element locators and web driver methods we can create and execute test cases okay na yeah. yeah next <clears throat> we already discussed web driver supports various uh, browsers uh, not discussed okay selenium web driver selenium web driver supports various browsers Uh, to create and execute tests to create and execute test cases you can say test case or test script or test synonyms see test <coughs> or test case or test script but in uft no test case term test or test script but in selenium official term is test case you can use other terms test script or test okay see <clears throat> using selenium web driver we can conduct cross browser testing cross browser testing i have already told <clears throat> test case is same <clears throat> no difference in creating test cases if it is firefox browser or ie browser or chrome browser any browser test cases same see element locator same web driver method same element locators for recognizing elements web driver methods for performing operations on elements element locator same web driver methods same then what is the difference what is the difference mohammed rahman already told element locator same web driver method same means test case same final conclusion test cases are same if it is any if it is chrome browser ie browser mozilla firefox browser safari opera then what is the difference how to execute test cases across multiple browsers Is it cross browser testing? Browser testing, okay. Okay, okay. Sri Lakshmi, can you tell me? Suppose I created some test cases using Mozilla Firefox browser. I want to execute these test cases using Google Chrome browser or IE browser or Safari browser or Opera browser. How to execute? i think the same process how you are uh, executing in the firefox ah same but uh, in the first topic i think first topic i told one uh, concept uh, what is that one browser driver 
Just we need to install the browser driver. Uh, no need to install. You can set path. Download browser driver and set path of the driver. Enough. No need to install browser drivers. Okay. See. Browser drivers. Browser drivers. Driver varies. From one browser to another one browser to another browser driver varies from one browser to another test case same okay now uh, srivalli any confusion uh, no here default driver is mozilla firefox default driver you no need to download and set path for Mozilla Firefox driver. You can directly create browser driver. You can directly create. If it is other, any other browser, Chrome or Mozilla, uh, sorry, or IE, you need to download browser driver and set the path that we will discuss in web driver practical chapters. See, supports various programming environments. Next, various browser environments. Next, various operating environments. See, Selenium web driver supports various operating operating environments. For example, Microsoft Windows, next Linux, next Mac, etc. Whereas EFT, formerly QTP, EFT supports only Microsoft Windows operating environment. Uh, Sri Lakshmi, anything else? Tell me one or two points about Selenium web driver. Covered maximum now. Operating environment, programming environment, browser environment. Next, how to create test cases and how to execute test cases. Next, drawbacks. See, uh, even though Selenium web driver is powerful tool, advanced tool, uh, it has some drawbacks also. Drawbacks. Drawbacks of Selenium web driver. Can you tell me, Preeti, one or two drawbacks of Selenium web driver? Just guess. Programming knowledge is needed. Programming knowledge is required. Okay. Ah. And, uh, programming, language, programming knowledge is required. Ah, anything else? It is open source, so uh, you know there is no proper help. Okay, that is uh, that disadvantage for entire suit. Entire suit, not only for web driver. That we will discuss uh, in another topic. Advantage of Selenium, drawbacks of Selenium suit. Ah, uh, see, one of the important drawback. It doesn't generate. It doesn't generate detailed test reports. It doesn't generate detailed test reports. Only summary. It generates summary only. For example, EFT. EFT tool generates detailed test reports. EFT has 
result window feature for every test iteration iteration means cycle of execution one test is there if you execute 10 times 10 iterations 10 test results for every test it, it uh, test iteration eft provides test result but uh, selenium provides summary only pass or fail like uh, it doesn't generate uh, detailed test reports next same as like selenium ide no centralized maintenance of objects no centralized maintenance of objects or you can say elements okay now these are the drawbacks uh, tushar tell me what are the important features of selenium web driver we discussed four five features quick important uh, features of selenium web driver selenium web driver uh, is a programming interface continue yeah it's a programming interface uh, and but it does not have id uh. and uh, it, it support the java c sharp Perl, python ruby Mm. those uh, programming languages mm. uh, and also uh, we can create the test cases using uh, element locators and also web driver methods ah. and uh, support various browsers to create uh, test cases mm. and uh, and also uh, uh, various operating environments yeah, support uh, various operating uh, good. environments good. Like windows linux yeah. okay windows linux macintosh etc okay uh, Sri Lakshmi, uh, drawbacks of Selenium web driver. Uh, it doesn't generate the any uh, like detailed report test clearly. reports. Yeah, detailed test report and uh, um, no centralized main maintenance of the elements. No centralized doesn't maintenance have. of elements. Good, good. Okay. Uh, one final uh, conclusion. This is a suggestion or recommendation. See, focus on, see in this uh, introduction to Selenium chapter, we discussed three topics. What is Selenium, history of the Selenium project and Selenium suit of tools. Uh, one more tool is there. After that, I will provide this uh, uh, suggestion. Last one, Selenium Grid. Selenium Grid. Uh, say, Selenium Grid. It is not mandatory to use. First of all, it doesn't support creating test cases. It is not for test case design. Selenium grid is not for test case design. It is only for test execution. It is only for test execution. Here you can ask one question. Suppose if it is Selenium IDE or Selenium RC or Selenium web driver, they support execution also. Apart from test case design, they support execution also then why we need to use selenium grid selenium grid only for test execution not for test design okay it supports parallel test execution parallel test execution see selenium grid selenium grid is used to is used to execute tests across multiple browsers next operating environments operating environments 
नेक्स्ट एंड मेशन्स मीन्स कंप्यूटर्स सी सेलिनियम ग्रिड इज यूज टू एक्सिक्यूट टेस्ट अक्रॉस मल्टीपल ब्रउजर्स आपरेटिंग एनविरास अंड मेशन इन पारल पारल से पारल टेस्ट एग्जिक्यूशन सो दट वी कैन रेड्यूस द टाइम Suppose I have hundred test cases. I want to execute these test cases using Google Chrome browser, IE browser, Mozilla browser. You can take two or three missions, execute all hundred test cases using IE browser in first mission, using Chrome browser in second mission, using another Mozilla browser in third mission. See, using Selenium Grid, we can execute test cases in parallel across multiple browsers, operating environments, and machines in parallel. Okay, now Vijay, did you understand this concept? Yes, I did. Ah, uh, first of all, Selenium Grid doesn't support test case design, isn't it? It is only for test execution. Yes. Next. selenium 2 supports selenium grid 2 grid supports selenium rc tests as well as selenium web driver web driver tests <clears throat> say selenium grid 1 one, one version supports only selenium rc <clears throat> but selenium grid 2 supports selenium rc or selenium web driver test cases suppose i created 100 test cases using selenium web driver i can execute all 100 test cases in parallel using selenium grid or selenium rc test cases you can use selenium grid for parallel test execution but here you can find one limit we cannot execute selenium ide test cases using selenium grid got this points sevalli pranati Pranati, did you understand this concept? Yes, sir. We can execute Selenium RC test cases or Selenium web driver test cases using uh, in parallel using Selenium Grid, but but not Selenium IDE test cases. See, simple one. Selenium Grid doesn't support test case design. it is only for test execution execution in parallel parallel see primary purpose of selenium grid is parallel test execution using multiple browsers operating environments and machines you can conduct parallel test execution okay see uh, before closing the session one suggestion say we have four selenium tools and six supporting languages you can use any one but my recommendation is suggestion is focus on focus on uh, three uh, important things first one selenium web driver selenium web driver next java programming java programming next framework required testing framework you can use either that that that, that, that i will explain later just a brief idea 
you can use either j unit or test ng but test ng is more powerful than j unit both are same in purpose you can use either j unit or test ng test ng is more powerful than j unit in our training program we will discuss test ng framework if you familiar with test ng framework definitely you can cope up with j unit or any other frameworks see test ng framework you focus on these three concepts what is the purpose of uh, selenium web driver to create and uh, okay to create and execute also to create test cases using element element locators and web driver methods technical term is method business term is operation next <clears throat> to enhance test cases say using program programming features you can enhance test cases you can insert verification points add comments parameterization synchronization if required next test ng framework to group test cases next and generate to group test cases execute test batches and generate detailed test reports detailed test reports see you focus these three uh, concepts uh, we will continue tomorrow last question for that is salim uh, sayed alam tell me uh, focus on three important things uh, selenium web driver selenium uh, java programming and test ng framework uh, just uh, tell me the purpose selenium web driver for <coughs> Uh, so Selenium web driver uh, to, to create test cases using uh, element locator and uh, web driver methods. Ah. Uh, you can use uh, Java programming to enhance uh, test cases. Ah. And uh, the third one was uh, uh, test ng framework uh, for uh, group test case, cases, ah. execute cases, uh, batch. Uh, test batch, uh, batch testing. Batch testing. Yeah. Like, batch of testing. Ah. Detail tester uh, reports. Okay. And this is more powerful uh, than the J unit. J unit. J. Okay.